Hi preschoolers, it's Miss Jill, and today we are going to make a craft together. The things that you need for this craft you should already have, and they should be in the bag that you got for our class this week. So the things that you need, I'll just show you. You'll need a piece of paper like this, and the piece of paper has a little fold in the middle, and you might want to use that fold. So you can make sure that your paper is folded like that, but we'll start out with it open. And you'll need a bottle of paint. There's brown paint in this bottle. And then you'll need two brown bear ears, okay? And a bear nose and mouth. And a couple of bear eyes. They're gonna be bear eyes today, okay? You'll also want some glue. And you got a glue stick in your bag, but you might use white glue instead. It doesn't really matter what kind of glue. It could be any kind of glue, preschoolers, okay? The first step is maybe the funnest, and we're going to use our paint for it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put little dots of brown paint on one side of this paper, and so that I make sure I'm only doing it on one side, I think I might just fold my paper, and then I'm going to put small dots. We don't want to put big, huge dots because then they'll leak out. What we're going to do is fold this and smush it. So little dots, but you know, we want it to be pretty covered. So we're making our little brown bear here. Just lots of little dots. There we go. And then I'm going to fold it and kind of smush it around. So you might want a grown up to help you with this part just to make sure we get it folded right. And we'll fold it. It's a good idea to do this project on a, this is a table that Miss Jill can wipe off or to do it on, on a table and put some um, newspaper down so that you don't get paint on your table because it can leak out. That does happen. So what I'm doing now is I'm smooshing the paint around. I can kind of even feel it under my fingers, smooshing around on that paper underneath. And it's kind of spreading out all over. Oh, see, there I spread some out on my table, but that's okay, this is a table that I can wipe off. So I might've put a little bit too much paint down there. Let's see if this looks like a bear. Ready? I'm gonna hold it up for you to see. There's our brown bear face. Now, it kind of looks like a brown bear head right now, but we're going to make it look even more like a brown bear, and we're going to add some pieces to it. Now, if you want to wait for this to dry and then add your pieces, you can. Miss Jill is going to add the pieces now so that you can see what that might look like. So, first thing I'm going to do is give him some ears. So, here's my ears. They kind of look like a U or a half oval. And I'm gonna put some glue on there. Now, a little secret is that if you put these on while your paint is wet, you might not even really need glue. Your paint might kind of look like glue. But just to be safe, we're gonna put a little bit of glue on our ears. And then I'm gonna decide where a good place for my bare ears might be. I'm gonna be careful because this is really wet. And let's see. Hmm, I'm trying to decide if I want my bear to look like this or like this. Hmm. Does that look more like a bear face? Okay, I think I'll go with this because these do kind of already look like ears, don't they, preschoolers? Okay, I think I'll go with that. And I think I'm going to put my ears kind of where those little bumps were. Okay, there's my ears. All right, now I need to decide where I want his nose and mouth to go. So I'm gonna put a little bit of glue on his nose and mouth. And I think we're gonna put his nose and mouth right there. Oh, he's looking more like a bear all the time. 
Now, these googly eyes are the pieces that you might need to use a bottle of glue for, but we're gonna try a glue stick. And Miss Jill's gonna kind of put of a lot of our glue on from our glue stick so we make it nice and sticky. But here's one eye. I'm gonna get the other eye all glued up. Here's a little bit more glue. It's a little easier to use more glue when you're using a bottle of glue. You have to get kind of... All right, so here's our eyes. And let's figure out where our eyes should go on our bear. Him look so so much more like he has character now that he has eyes and can look at us okay there's my bear there's his eyes and ears and mouth and there's miss jill's brown bear now preschoolers i think you will have so much fun making your own bear and i think when you do you will find out that your bear will look completely different than Miss Jill's bear. And I'm so excited to see what all of your bears look like because they all have kind of the same pieces like this, but this smushy painting is going to be different for all of us. So I'm excited to see what all of those look like. Share your pictures with me so that we can see that. All right, well, you have fun making your bears and we'll see you later. Bye-bye, preschoolers.